From Jet 24, here's meteorologist Tom Atkins, your weather authority. Take you out to the western horizon on our U.S. netting cam. This is the top of uh, St. Peter Cathedral. Sun just went down over that deck of uh, cumulus clouds out there. Now, if you turn it around to the other horizon on Conneaut Lake, you got the moon. So this is where you start getting towards the full moon, which is technically tomorrow. The moon is rising when the sun on the other horizon is setting. So beautiful weather optics tonight. Channel lock cam there. Here's a beautiful shot reminding us that it's still winter. Look at the freezing fog on the trees in French Creek, New York, against the blue skies. Thanks, Becky Linton, uh, for that great shot. So a little bit of everything for everyone, but we, of course, are headed to March Madness, and anything can happen in this part of the country in March. What's happening here is just a few sprinkles trying to get into east central Ohio. The main punch of this storm is to the south, and you see a little mix here. Uh, in the mountains of West Virginia and Virginia. So the precipitation south and east of 90 could start, it will start late tonight, and it could start in those higher elevations as a little wet snow or mix, but that's not going to last long. Here are your numbers from ERI today. 41 for the high, and I believe it has also gotten up to 42 in the last hour or so. Regardless, the low was 21 under those clear skies this morning. So. As we look at other stats, no precipitation, still very close to normal for the month. Look at the uh, sunrise this morning right at 7. It just set at 6.08, and we're up to 11 hours and 8 minutes of daylight. So that rain or a little rain and snow mix inland after midnight. Mainly showers in the morning tomorrow, but we start to get milder. Sunday, chance of more showers, mainly in the morning, but we're even warmer on Sunday. So temperatures right now basically from 35 to 40 degrees in sections of Erie and Chautauqua counties. As we go down south, uh, temperatures across Crawford County, same spread, 35 to 40. It's a tranquil night. We still have the clear skies out east into the mountains and uh, 35 to 39 in those regions as well. So here it comes from the south, precipitation shield with a low pressure area towards the Gulf of Mexico. And you can see it on maps in motion. Around and after midnight comes in, the pink and blue goes away. We have showery periods in the morning, and then they move out to the east in the afternoon. So we have this dry setup for Saturday evening with high pressure, and then look what happens Monday morning. Around 6 a.m., or Sunday morning, excuse me, we have showers that kick out on Sunday afternoon. The next thing that's going to affect us is this front coming down from the northwest. And uh, it's going to bring with it some wind as we start the month of March. Great animation here by Craig Flint. Burst of snow showers on uh, the 1st on Monday. Windy conditions, then sun takes over, and a chilly Tuesday. All in all, nothing all that bad. Jet pinpoint for Erie and the Lakeshore for tonight. Low temperatures dropping to 35 and starting to rise as winds pick up and rain comes down after midnight. Uh, inland zones, Southern Erie, Crawford, Mercer, and Venango counties, some rain, possibly a little wet snow after midnight, 32 to 36. Your temps will likely rise towards morning as well. Jamestown, Warren, Tyoneston in the mountains, rain, a little wintry mix. Temperatures in the low 30s. And then, look at this, they go up into the mid-40s tomorrow, but mainly morning showers. And the rain goes away, and the temperatures go back down, but uh, no precipitation, dry on your Saturday night. Another shot on Sunday, less rain that day, warmer temperatures, 53. There's those gusty winds in the front coming through with snow showers on Monday. Not expected to be heavy, but an abrupt change to a 35 on Tuesday. And as stated, Wednesday through Friday, we're bouncing around just like we do normally in March around here. Check out those weather cameras on the weather page at your eerie.com. Shut and chill.